Hi, Mariano. Hi, teacher. Sorry, How teacher. I'm going to my house. Oh, okay, Maria. That's okay. That's fine. Voy saliendo exactamente ahorita del trabajo. Oh, no, Mariano, no se preocupe. Está bien, con cuidado entonces. Bueno, pero aquí lo vamos oyendo. Está bien, gracias. Oh, gracias a usted. Hi, Edwin. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? Um, very nice. Excellent. ¿Se siente mejor? Sí, sí, ya mucho mejor. Ah, super bien. Que me alegro. Gracias. Very nice. Thank you. Hi, Daniel. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine. I'm great. How are you today? Nice. Nice. Happy. I'm my home. <laughs> yes, you're you're in your vacations. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's something to be happy about. Yes. How many days do you have? 21 or 15? Mm -hmm. 21 days or 15 days? No, 15 days. Okay. Mm -hmm. And those those are like every every year. Every year, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And do they rotate? Or do you have them like at the same time of the year? Uh, no, same in uh, one one same time. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, that's pretty cool. All right, hi Johnny. Hi teacher. How are you today, Johnny? I'm fine. Uh, but I'm sleepy. You're sleepy. Yes. Oh no. <laughs> Why? Don't be sleepy. It's only um it's only what when Thursday ah no it's Thursday already. Yes. Wow. Yo no sentí la semana. <laughs> Very good. Hi Maritza. Hi, good evening. How are you, Maritza? I'm fine, teacher. Excellent. Very good. Boy, niño, solo quiero ver una cosa aquí. All right, very good, guys. So welcome to another class. We are going to continue talking about scheduled activities. So that means that we are going to keep on using simple present, okay? So that's what we will continue talking about here. So let's see. Hi, Alexander, Francisco. Hello, Jorge. How are you? Todo bien? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm uh, fine, you? I'm great. Thank you. All right, guys. I'm just checking. I just need something here, guys, but I'm here. Just let me just get this right here. Hold on. Okay, so yesterday, I think we finished with the questions. ¿Solo las hicieron o las, lo, o las preguntamos? Recuérdenme. No, preguntó a algunos. Yo le dije las mías. Ajá, es cierto. Algunos sí me yo, dijeron, yo ¿verdad? También, yo, yo, yo también dije las mías. Excelente. <laughs> ok. All right, speaking about everyday tasks. Ok. Very good. I'm just closing this here. Ok. Very good. All right, so, ah, uh, yeah, I ever was with me yesterday too. Hoy le toca a Fátima quedarse conmigo. No ha entrado Fátima todavía. No. Ok. All right, guys. So, let's see. De los que está, están ahorita acá, ¿quiénes no me dijeron las preguntas ayer? Algunas de las preguntas que lograron hacer. O todos me dijeron. No, ¿verdad? Me faltaron algunos, creo. ¿Te recuerdan? Teníamos unas preguntas antes de terminar ayer. Did you finish those questions? No eran preguntas. No, ¿verdad? No eran preguntas. Eran las actividades que ustedes y sus compañeros hacían. Yes. Eran yes. All right. Sentences. Uy. Ahí van los camiones. Ya <laughs> volado su cinco. Ups, sí. De hecho, ya es como el tercero. A las ocho empiezan. <laughs> Ahí viene otro. All right. Let's see. Um, Carlos Alberto, did you tell me the sentences yesterday about you and people at your work? Please. Uh, 
Uh, I'm not finished the, the, the sentences. The sentences. Oh, no, Carlos. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's okay. Maritza, what about you? Um, Did you tell me your sentences yesterday, Maritza? No. Okay. No, Do you have them ready? Yes. Okay, can I hear them, please? Um, the schedule, the, my partner, um, Angela Aleman, plan manager. Okay. Control, control the production. Um, Rosa Basket, cook. Okay. She cook breakfast and lunch for manager. Oh, okay. Edgardo Lemus, uh -huh. security supervisor. All right. Um, keep order around the office. Ah, okay. In the morning, afternoon, or all day? All day. Okay, all right, very good. Okay, now, um, Maritza, do you have and a specific activity that you do at a certain hour every day or not really it varies yes um for example uh -huh. at 7 30 uh -huh. check my email oh every day maritza every day oh, okay at the um, I prepared the document for signature. Ah, okay. At, at 9, 12, and 3 p.m. Oh, every day. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay. Very good. Now, Maritza, what happens if you don't have those documents ready for signature? What happens? Oh. Um, bien complicado. <laughs> Okay. Um, the document, um, the document, the firmas is transference. Uh huh. Um, um, check is check. Uh huh. Um, this check is for pay to the suppliers. No. Proveedores. Suppliers. Suppliers. Okay. Very important. Okay. Very important for the the material of the plan. Okay. For the production, the the material. Okay. All right. All right. Very nice. Interesting. Thank you. Let's see. What about um. Ever. Is there something that you do every day ever at the same time or not really? Like, or at least in the morning, always in the morning or always in the afternoon or not really? Uh, good evening, everyone. everyone. Yes, I have a one at Twitty. Uh, Around two nine o'clock in the morning, I review my schedule about to be to my customer and that's a that's a point every day, the five days of the week. All right, now what happens if you don't? Well the the sales, we don't have the sales. I am the only person in a church with this department. All right, okay, so that, that's a big problem then. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh, all it, right. The, how do you say the, the, the column of, of, Yes, of the yes, of course, yes. okay. Okay, interesting, very good, okay. Let's see, what about 
Johnny, is there something that you do every day in the school at the same time? At 7 10 a.m., I teach to kindergarten. Okay, all right. Every day at the same hour? Every day. And what happens if you don't teach that class to kindergarten? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Do you have a substitute teacher? No. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Very good. So the kids have no class. Yes. Okay. La, the teacher of the grade. Uh huh. Uh, angry. <laughs> because He's angry. Because Johnny don't come today. All right. Yeah. Okay. That's their free hour. That's their spare hour. <laughs> Yes. Okay, Johnny, interesting. Very good. Amilcar. Hi, Amilcar. Hi, teacher. How are you? Fine. All right, Amilcar, is there something, is there an activity that you do every day at the same time? Same time? Yes. Like, let's say, for example, always at 9 in the morning or always at 3 p.m. or always in the morning no importa pero tiene que ser antes del mediodía or something afternoon but has to be in the afternoon oh let me see activity before afternoon or every every, every day. time during yeah, the every, day uh -huh. it doesn't matter but something that you have to do every day que no pueden no hacerlo porque si no something happens um now for this day for example uh, we have a day free or free days uh of my work and every day i i thinking about my my songs and for example before before the classmate I play with my son or my daughter. Any, 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 como se dice cualquiera, de cualquier cosa. About Siempre anything, jugamos. about anything. Yes. Okay, okay. Play. Now, what happens, Amilcar, if you don't play with your children? What happens? The, my children is very hungry. Uh, Angry? Angry uh, and come on, boring. And bored, uh huh. Yes. And until until my dog is very is very bad. Oh my because goodness. We we play with until my dog to incline oh. in 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 the in the game in the game in oh. the game. Okay. Ah. Oh. All right. Okay. Amilcar, you're using until, porque hasta, hasta el perro. Yes. Sí, ah, ok. Solo que until es una preposición de tiempo. La que estamos necesitando ahorita es cuando usted dice, even my dog, aún mi perro, even. All right, okay. interesting, nice, very good, Amilcar, excellent. Ok, guys, very good. So, today, we're going to be talking about activities that we have to do in the workplace or in your house and what happens if you don't okay so remember that what i'm trying to do is to ask you more questions so you speak more because when you go to the intermediate level you're speaking speaking and speaking more okay so you need to be ready for that i'm gonna take attendance right now all right so here we have carlos roberto garcia ramirez all right, Carlos Walberto Rodriguez. Present. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present. Domingo Alexander González. Present. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Viva. Present, teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. 
Present teacher. Fátima Alejandra Centeno Franco. Gilmar Cruz Méndez Méndez. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jonathan Alexander Pineda Díaz. Jorge Elvir Miranda Ramos. José Francisco Hernández Ábalos. Present. Thank you. Carla Benazir Lara González. Present. Hi. Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Present. María Melina Iraeta de Salinas. All right. Maritza Alcira Castellón Celaya. Present teacher. Misael Rivera Aquino. Nancy Lisset Rodríguez Escoto. Romeo Alexis Rodríguez Joaquín. Yasmín Melanie Lemos Rodríguez. Present teacher. Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Thank you. Um, Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Present teacher. Mariano José Pacas Santa María. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present. ¿Está Jorgito? Ah, sí, está. <ríe> Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Victoria María. Y no se preocupe, Vicky, ya, ya la escuché. A ver, Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Anda, Milcar Cañengues Aceituno. Present. Thank you. All right. Very good, guys. Thank you. Okay. So before we um, keep on talking about the things that you guys do, I need to show you the book right now. Okay. So here we have. We finished this yesterday. We finished this here yesterday. And we talked about the questions. And now, otro ratito vamos a regresar a este ejercicio. Write five questions on your own and ask them to a classmate. All right. Right now, let's go to page 25, unit two. I will be able to describe a colleague's routine at the workplace. All right. A ver, Francisco, ayúdeme con la lectura. Number one, let's start. Esta de aquí, Frank. Okay. Who interview future employees in your company? Lead five, five activities you do, you do in a regular day. All right, very good. Thank you. Yes, Francisco. Regular day. Yeah. Who interviews future? Who interviews future employees in your company? List five activities you do in a regular day. All right. A ver. Um, Jasmine, la, pre la primera pregunta, Jasmine, donde dice, who interviews future employees in your company? Who? In your company, Jasmine? Who makes the interviews? Entendemos eso, Jas? Perdón, no lo escuché muy bien. Sí, la pregunta donde dice número uno, donde dice, who interviews future employees in your company? En la empresa donde usted labora, Jazz, ¿quién hace las entrevistas? Who interviews? The manager, teacher. Ah, the manager interviews future employees. O sea, la, la jefa, o sea, la... <laughs> ok, la gerente o el gerente es el que hace las entrevistas en su empresa, ¿sí? Sí. Yeah. All right. Okay. What about Jorge in your company? Jorge Argueta in your company who interviews employees. Um. Interview. 
Ah, ¿Me puede repetir, por favor, Sí, sí, sí. ¿Quién, quién hace las entrevistas en su, en su empresa? Who interviews future employees in your company? Um, and Joe. You. You, sí. Oh, wow, Jorge, really. Excellent. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Very I nice. An interview. <laughs> All right, Nunca tuve una entrevista de trabajo que, que me la hicieran a mí. Oh, my goodness, Jorge. Very nice. Interesting. Okay. Hola. I want a question. Ajá. For example, in, the, in this question, who interviews, why don't use, does or don't? Uh, because Ajá. I think about the, the action implícito. In. Porque en ningún momento se da la idea de quién hace las entrevistas, o sea, no está el verbo implícito en la, en la oración, aunque al traducirlo usted acaba de decir quién hace, sí, sí. pero el verbo hacer no lo veo en la estructura. Ok, a ver, le voy a explicar, voy a dejar de compartir aquí, es una muy buena pregunta, de hecho, um, a Milcar, all right, who interviews, a ver, en este caso hay dos cosas que hay que explicar, una, All right. El verbo que estamos usando es interviews. Ese es el verbo. Who interviews. Acuérdese que does, como usted bien me dijo, ¿verdad? No veo ni el do ni el does. El does sería auxiliar, no el verbo. Ok. okay pero Ahora, no está, ah, exacto, no está. Porque cuando hacemos la pregunta con, usando el WH question who, como no sabemos si es una persona, dos personas, tres personas, no sabemos si es singular o plural, omitimos el auxiliar, ¿ok? Y asumimos que, que va a ser, que como no sabemos quién es, siempre le vamos a poner S al verbo y no vamos a poner auxiliar. Esa excepción se hace con who, ¿ok? No con where, no con what, no con when, no con ninguna otra, excepto con who. Hola. Daniel. Mr. Daniel o Mr. Johnny. Hola. Hola. Please. Perdón, ya regresé, me escuchan. Hola, aquí estoy, aquí estoy, me escuchan. Sí. Yes, teacher. Perdonen, yes. solo denme un segundito aquí, porfa. Ok. Hold on, guys. Denme un segundito. No consulta nada. Ah. No va a calentar nada. De las copas es que no lo va a comer. O sea que fueron a rifar lo que estaba en la refri. Ponerla en un papel de aluminio, encimita. Jasmine, I hear you. Hi, guys, sorry. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. All right, sorry, guys. Hoy sí me escuchan bien, no me estoy trabando. No, estoy bien. Ok. All right, very good. Thank you. Okay. All right. Entonces decía que con el who es una excepción, ¿verdad? No vamos a ocupar ni, nu, ni do ni does y al verbo le vamos a agregar s o s o y s en su defecto, ¿verdad? Entonces lo tratamos como que fuera singular. Ok. Ok, ok. Entonces si se fija a Milcar, a Milcar y todos, vemos en esa pregunta dice who interviews. 
Yes. All right, who interview sería singular. Y omitimos el do y omitimos el das. Ok. Excellent, excellent. All right, ahora, cuando usted contesta, usted dice, the manager interviews, all right, the people, or human resources. O en el caso de Jorge dice, I do, I do the interviews, ok. Excellent. O puede decir, I interview the, the, stu the student, the people, or the employees, o quien sea que usted entreviste, ok. Entonces, si yo le digo, por ejemplo, ¿quién encendió la luz? Ok, o quién cocinó, who cooks in this house? Y usted me dice, ah, my wife, I do, everybody, o sea, iba a depender quién cocina, pero lo que voy a, es que no vamos a poner ni do ni das, ok? Excellent. Teacher. Excellent, very good question, amiga, thank you. All right, anything else? A ver. So here we have, entonces regresamos a la pregunta who interviews, ¿verdad? A ver, en el caso de Daniel, who interviews in your company? In my company, we have a ex, ex human resource uh, assistant. He, she is the who interviews to the future employees. The new employees. All right, perfect, yeah. very good. Okay. Um, what about Marco in your company? Who interviews the new employees, Marco? In my case, uh, interviews human resource and uh, my boss too, but okay. only the 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 pro right okay. right. Okay. Uh, human resource and the police, my my boss. Okay, interesting. Very good. Okay, one more. Let's see. Maria Melina, in your company, who interviews the people? Um, the owner of the business teacher. Ah, okay. The owner. Uh, yeah, the owner. Okay. All right. Yes. Interesting. Okay. Very good. Okay. Let's go to the to the um conversation here. Ahorita comparto. A ver, solo vi que entró Fátima. ¿Quién más me entró a la clase? Fátima entró. Ah, uh, creo que solo hay entonces. All right, okay. So let's share here. Ya vamos a poner a Fátima ahí. Okay, so here we have this, guys. The, in, the, the conversation, it says, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner. Celia and Marcos. Good morning, Marcos. How is your day going? Pretty good. I just finished interviewing some potential employees. Then I have to talk to the staff about, the, about some changes in the schedule. I see. I saw some people in the reception when I came. Yes, I rescheduled some of them, to, uh, some of them tomorrow. I need to make some calls in some minutes. Anyways, how about you? Just the usual, checking that the personnel is ready and ordering the inventory. I thought ordering the inventory was Janet's job. All right, so here's the conversation. La vamos a, a practicar un par de veces, all right? A ver, Johnny, please be Celia. Ana Milcar, please be Marcos. Okay. Good morning, Marcos. How is your day going? Pretty good. I just finished inter interviewing some potential employees. Then I have to talk to talk to the staff about some change in the schedule. I see. I saw some people in the reception when I came. Yes, I rescheduled some of them tomorrow. I need to make some calls in some minutes. Anyway, how about you? Just the usual. Checking that the personnel is ready and ordering the inventory. I thought ordering 
the inventory was Janet Jones. Jones. Excellent. Yes, very good, Amilcar. Thank you, Johnny. Very good. Very nice. Let's see. Vamos a ver quién más. Marlon, can you please be Celia? Uh, Carlos o Alberto, can you please be Marcos? Okay, teacher. Good morning, Marcos. How's your day going? Very good. I just finished. I just finished interview. Interviewing some potential employees. Then I have to talk to the staff about some changes in the schedule. I see. I saw some people in the reception when I came. Yes, we schedule some of them tomorrow. I need to make some calls in some minutes. Anyways, how about you? Just the usual, checking at the personal list ready and ordering the inventory. I too, ordering the inventory was Janet's job. Excellent, thank you. All right, Fatima, you're going to be Celia. And... Victoria Juarez, can you be Marcos? Mariano se va después. Thank you, Mariano. Good morning, Marcos. How is your day going? Victoria, no. Escucha. Sí, sí, escucha? sí. Sí, sí, ahorita sí, le escucho. Es que tengo problemas con, con, con el... Pero... Vaya. Very good. I was finished interview some potential employees. Then I have to talk to the staff about some changes in the schedule. I see. I saw some people in the reception when I came. Yes, I rescheduled. Re, no, rescheduled. Rescheduled. Sí, estaba bien. Muy bien. Uh -huh. Res, ah, okay. Rescheduled some of them tomorrow. I need to make some calls in some minutes. And, and why? How about you? Just the usual. Checking that the personnel is ready and ordering the inventory. I thought ordering the inventory was Janet Hope. Excellent. Very good. Okay. So here we have, I'm going to read it one more time. All right, it says, good morning, Marcos. How's your day going? Pretty good. I just finished interviewing some potential employees. Then I have to talk to the staff about some changes in the schedule. I see. I saw some people in the reception when I came. Yes, I rescheduled some of them tomorrow. Wait. I need to make some calls in some minutes. Anyways, how about you? Just the usual, checking the personnel is ready and ordering the inventory. I thought ordering the inventory was Janet's job, okay? So that is the conversation. Please check if there are any, any words that you don't know or that you want to check the pronunciation on. Uh, sure. For example, teacher, interview we interview wing. Así es. The interviewing. Sí, sí, sí. Repeat, please. Interviewing. interviewing. Yes. Acuérdense que viene la palabra interview, ¿verdad? Interview. Ajá. Uh -huh. All right. Entonces sería interviewing. Viewing and in termina la pronunciación. And in, uh -huh, aha, interviewing. Uh -huh. Y la otra teacher, reschedule. Sí, muy bien, rescheduled. Reagendar es teacher. Sí, es reagendar o re, uh -huh. 
Reprogramar. reprogramar. Volver, re, baja, reprogramar, volver a agendar. Yes, rescheduled. Ok. Rescheduled. ¿Algo más? ¿Anything else? Yes. Rescheduled. Re, rescheduled. Re, rescheduled. Rescheduled. Yes. Okay. Very good. Yes. Ok. A ver, ¿algo más que se nos quede por ahí? A veces, bueno, lo noté ayer, no tengamos miedo de hacer esta pronunciación. La estoy poniendo ahí, no sé si la, la resalté, no sé si la pueden ver. Ahorita. Vamos a ver, la vamos a poner en pink. Esta que está aquí. Changes. Changes. Yes. All right. Change es uno y cambio son changes. Ok. Changes. Ya, yeah. so, tal vez lo escuchan como algo divertidito, pero así se dice, no hay problema. Changes, ¿ok? Changes. 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 It's like, it's like a baby's toy. Changes. Uh -huh. <laughs> Very good. A ver, ¿otra? ¿Se nos queda alguna otra? No, everything is it's ok. Ok. Uh, uh, the, uh, the word soul. Ah, en hey Marcos. Yes. Ok, yes. Marcos es I thought ordering. Acuérdese que thought es el pasado de think. Ok, ahí está. Entonces pensé que ordenar el, el inventario era el trabajo no, de Janet. Uh -huh. okay. All right, very good. Ok, a okay. ver. Ahí individual lo vamos a. Dígame. Este, después de. Change, changes. Ajá. El S, S me cuesta pronunciar un poquito. Es, pero lo pronuncia bien, changes. No, changes no. sí, leí. Yeah. Ah, ok. ¿Cuál era el entonces, lo, perdón? El que le sigue. Chel, schedule. Es, ah, es, schedule. Es, es scheduled. Es, es Empieza con scheduled. Es scheduled. No es S. No es como que fuera ES, es schedule. ¿Sí me entiende la diferencia? Sí, con S. Con S. Exacto, empieza con S, no con ES. Ya, yeah, very good. Uh -huh. Sketch, sketch. 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 Ya, se vuelve scheduled. Con D al final. Schedule. 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 Yes. Uh, for example, in the expression them, uh, in la primera intervención de Marcos. Sí. Al final dice, then I have to talk, uh, yes, to, talk to talk to, uh -huh. to, the, to staff. the staff. Sí. Staff, entiendo que puede ser equipo, planilla. Sí, staff no, se, no, refiere, no. Ajá, se refiere al, al, al personal del... del trabajo, ¿verdad? De la empresa. Personal de a las apoyo. personas. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces sería como al equipo de trabajo. Sí, exacto. Ya, yeah, that's right. Okay, okay. Ajá, usted Thank puede you. decir, in my office, there are, the staff is very um, experienced. All right, the staff or the personnel. The staff podría sustituir la expresión mis compañeros, por ejemplo, de trabajo, co um, No, porque una cosa es su compañero de trabajo y otra cosa es todo el personal de la empresa, aunque sí trabajen no, en la no, misma no, empresa, ¿verdad? But, pero por lo general cuando usted no se refiere a... Ya, yeah, ajá, es como my, my co-workers, ¿verdad? Ellos son sus compañeros de trabajo. The staff of the office son todos, ¿verdad? Porque no todos son sus compañeros de trabajo. Específicamente. Oh, like ¿Ah? No sé, alguien dijo algo y no le Staff, escucha? staff is like a, a group. Yeah, a all group. right. A staff is synonym for personnel. Mire abajo donde dice Celia. Checking that the personnel is ready. Personnel es un sinónimo de staff. Okay, okay. Okay, yep. You. All right, very good. Okay, vamos a hacer esto. Solo déjeme un ratito, déjeme un segundo. Vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Quiero que hagamos dos actividades en una. 
Nos vamos a ir a los grupos. Y la palabra changes. Vamos a poner stop. Vaya, vaya anotando ahí, o se, se, se la voy a subrayar yo. Ya, ya subrayé changes, aquí está. Vamos a poner staff. Vamos a poner interviewing. Employees, van cuatro. Reschedule, puede, puede, ya sea, usted puede escoger entre rescheduled o nada más schedule. Cualquiera de estas dos. Uh, let me see. Two, four, five, six. Vamos a ver con um, inventory. Ok. Quiero que me hagan oraciones usando estas palabras. All right. Si usted puede, digamos, incluir dos o tres palabras en una misma oración, perfecto. Si no, si les cuesta mucho o les sale muy difícil, one word per sentence. La idea fuera como poner más palabras dentro de una misma oración. Tal vez no las seis, ¿verdad? Pero si alguna, aunque sea dos por cada oración, sería genial. Ok, esa es actividad uno. Actividad dos, I want you to answer these questions. Ok. Yes. yes. These questions are about this conversation here. Ok, guys. All right. Aportaron las palabras. Es interviewing, employees, staff, changes, reschedule, and inventory. Yes, ok. Yes. All right. Voy a dejar de compartir aquí, Nancy. ¿Quién más entró después que no le tomé la asistencia cuando la tomé? Nancy. Sí, Nancy, ya la vi, gracias. Yo sí estaba, teacher, sí, sí, sí. pero tuve un corte. Sí, sí no sé. yo, pero yo la vi, Vicky, que iba ahí caminando. Gracias. All right, very good. Ok, los mando ahorita entonces a los grupos.
Ya estamos. Ah, cabal, <risa> Johnny. Bueno, ya, ah. ya lo activé, Johnny. Ok. Thank you. Eso era, ¿verdad? <risa> sí, eso era. <risa> ok. Siempre cuando veo Johnny digo, oh, no. <risa> De eso se acuerda. Ya, <risa> yeah, pero no por algo malo. <risa> ah, vaya. Ok. Hi, Misael. Hi, Misael, me escucha. Hello, teacher. Misael, lo voy a mandar a un grupo para que escuche lo que están haciendo. Bueno, gracias.
All right, guys, did you finish? Yes. Yes, excellent. Very good. All right, Daniel, tell me one sentence, Daniel. One sentence. Okay. We need change in the schedule of employees. Daniel, I'm sorry, can you repeat it again? Uh, we need changes in the schedule of employees. All right, okay, very nice. I like that sentence, very nice, thank you. Let's see, um, Maritza, tell me the sentence that you came up with. Si en caso digo a alguien y estaban en el mismo grupo, como hicieron más oraciones, me dice otro, no hay problema. A ver, Maritza. Maritza, your microphone is off, Maritza. Sorry, teacher. That's okay. Uh, the employees arrive on time every day. Very good, and, thank you, I like that. Yes, okay, uh, thank you, uh-huh. Okay, in the other sentences, okay. I need change, change to project inventories. Okay, all right. Uh, usando la palabra change and inventory, yes? Inventory. Okay, yes. very good, thank you, very good. Let's see, Um, ouch. Uh, Marlon, tell me your sentence, y después va Jasmine, después va Fatima, okay, Marlon. Okay, teacher. We have to reschedule the appointments. Excellent, thank you, that's a nice sentence. Let's see, Jasmine and then Fatima. Teacher, de las preguntas no las había armado, solo, solo hicimos las de, las de la conversación. Las oraciones, Jasmine. Sí, las oraciones. Ah, vaya, sí, está bien, en eso estamos ahorita. Si gusta, dígame una. Pero de las, de, no, las oraciones no las hicimos. Ah, este, no hicieron las oraciones. Hicimos la conversación, pero si quiere, eh, déjeme de último y la armo ahorita. Vaya, sí, está bien. Ok, con el vocabulario que yo les, les subrayé en rosadito. Muy bien, gracias. Fátima, tell me one, please. Ok. The human, the human resource assistant is interviewing the new personal staff of sales. Oh, very nice. I like that sentence. Very good, Fatima. Nice sentence. All right. Maria Melina, and then Vicky, Dinora, and then Ever. The company is checking the staff schedules. Oh, nice. I like that one. Very nice. Thank you. And the second one. The human resource manager is doing some employees changes. Oh, very nice. Yes, thank you. All right, um, perfect. My boss is interviewing some new employees for okay. to do the inventory. Oh, okay. Nice. Thank you, Maria Melina. Very good. Okay. Vicky, tell me more. Tell me one sentence, Vicky. Okay. The the actually did the staff have changes because they need ordering the inventory. Ah, they need order. Okay, they need to order the inventory. Okay, Vicky, very nice. Ever, tell me one, the Pueblo Mariano and Alexander. Okay, teacher. Uh, this one, we have to reschedule the company's inventory because change the product catalog. Oh, okay, because we changed the product. Okay, very nice, I like that one, thank you. Let's see, no me recuerdo si dije, ¿quién va después de Ever? Ah, Mariano, yes, and then Alexander, yes, uh -huh. Okay, the meeting with the staff are rescheduled for tomorrow. The meetings? The meetings with, with the staff. Okay, are rescheduled are for tomorrow. Schedule. Excellent, yes, okay. I like that one, very good, thank you. Alexander, tell me your sentence. Alexander, your sentence? Alexander, me escucha. No? Tiene su micrófono apagado, Alexander. No sé si me escucha usted a mí. 
Yes. Ah, ok, tell me one sentence. Uh, no, no tenía lista de esas las, las oraciones, dicho. Ah, bueno, ok. Ah, ok, that's ok. A ver. Um, Johnny, tell me your sentence, then Edwin, and then Carlos. Eduardo. Uh -huh. Ok. I interviewing the new math teacher. <laughs> okay, I'm interviewing the math, the new math teacher. All right, very good. Thank you. Next. Okay, uh, me teacher. Yes. Uh, my boss is interviewing new employee because a, a lot of employees <laughs> Edwin, discúlpeme, Misael, me ayuda con el micrófono, Misael, que no logra escuchar al compañero. Okay, okay. Permítame, a ver, ajá, dígame, hoy sí, dígame. My, my boss is interviewing new employees because a lot of employees go sit. Oh, ok. Yes, interviewing. Very good. Se apega mucho a nuestra realidad ahorita. <laughs> Very good, Edwin. Thank you. All right. Teacher, ya. Sí, 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 ya, Misael. Gracias. Ah. All right, maybe not. Ok, Carlita, tell me your sentence, Carlita, y luego seguimos con lo demás. Uh -huh. Y number one, Cualquiera que usted, que usted desee. Ya voy, Alexander. Voy, voy. Después va también a Milka. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, the cleaning staff is in training. Very good. The cleaning staff is in training. Yes, I like that one. Very good. Alguien me levantó la mano. Alexander, creo que fue. Yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, checking the that the personal is ready para, uh, uh, for working. Okay. All right. Very good. And Jasmine, tell me your sentence, Jas. Okay, este, the inventory was rescheduled re mm -hmm. for the interviews of new employees. I like that one, Jasmine. Very nice. Excellent, guys. Very good. Uh huh. My boss is employed for the new op operation. Okay, all right, very nice. Thank you. Amilcar, what about your sentence? Amilcar, your microphone. For example, I forgot reschedule some stuff. Eh, Otra vez, Amilcar, disculpe. I forgot reschedule some stuff tomorrow. Oh, my goodness, Amilcar. Yeah, very nice Thank sentence. You. Yes. <laughs> okay, very good. Excellent, guys. Let's uh, go back. Yes, me. yes. I have a, I don't say duda, but. I have a doubt. Uh -huh. Sí. Okay. Puse esta. I have been interviewing person all the morning pero el have been interviewing is a correct see 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 it's nice it's only. that's very that's a very good thank sentence you. i've been interviewing yeah okay very nice thank you okay let's continue then mm -hmm. here guys with this one number one okay. yes uh, can i say someone uh your bracelet is nice. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Daniel. Thank you. All I right. See it, it's nice. Yes. Thank you. All right. Okay. You're welcome. Okay. Number one, it says, what kind of job does Marcos have? A ver, who can answer that question for me? What is the answer for number one? What kind of job does Marcos have? Marcos is in charge of interview the potential employee. Marco is Marcos is in charge of interviewing some potential employees. Okay. All right. Alguien más tiene diferente. Uh -huh. Marcos is human resource 
resource manager. Yes, yes, yes. Marcos is a human yes. resource manager. Yes. Okay. Or maybe maybe production manager. Maybe maybe he ha maybe he is a production manager. Yes, of course. Or maybe he's a supervisor. El punto es teacher. que he makes interviews. Yes. Uh -huh. Teacher, teacher, uh, uh, excuse me. Uh, 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 human resources, uh, recursos humanos, ¿sí? Sí, human resources, human, yes. Human resources, uh, ¿cómo sería? Uh, buscando, sería boss, the of the human resources, o hay encontré una palabra que dice chief, the, of ¿Qué? the human resources. Eh, ¿qué, quiere de, ¿Qué quiere decir, Alexander? Perdón. Jefe, jefe, cuando dice ah. uno jefe de recursos humanos. Ajá. Usted puede decir Sería. human resources manager o human resources boss, pero manager es más, más usado quizás, Alexander. Y no habrá otra 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 antes. De, Para decir buscándolo. jefe, usted puede decir boss, chief, um, uh, chief headmaster. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Pero, yes. pero sería más convenable de manager. Para human resources, sí. Si solo usted dice, ah, mi jefe, sí, usted puede decir my chief, pero de hecho usamos más my boss. Ok. Ok. Very good, yes. thank you. All right, number two. What are some of his responsibilities? What is Marcos responsible for? He does interview and to check the schedule stuff. Okay, okay, so he, he does, okay. Podemos decir he does interviews or he makes interviews or he interviews. Cualquiera de esas tres, it's okay. All right, he interviews. Y la otra era, he checks the schedules. Organizes the interviews. Organizes interviews también, very nice, yes. Okay. Inform to the staff that changes in the schedules. Ok, perfect, very good. Ok, now, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Vamos a cambiar la pregunta 1 y 2 para que la puedan contestar with your information. So here, what I want you to do, eso lo vamos a contestar individual ahorita. Um, what kind of job? Uh, what kind of job do you do? All right, esa es la, con la primera que van a contestar, lo van a hacer individual antes de irnos a los grupos. Uy. Ay, no, se me movió. Permítame. Wait, guys. Ajá, lo vamos a poner aquí mejor. Y la otra that you I want you to answer is this. What are some of your responsibilities? All right. Contésteme esas dos ahorita. Eso es sobre usted. What kind of job do you do? Explíqueme qué trabajo hace. Yo no sé qué trabajo hace cada uno. What are some, uy, perdón. What are some of your responsibilities? Okay. Contestamos esas dos. Tome la, la, la asistencia a la segunda hora, ¿no? ¿Verdad? No. Ahorita, en lo que están trabajando, yo la tomo. Okay, sure. All right, a ver. Um, Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Carlos o Alberto Rodríguez. Present. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present. Domingo Alexander González. Present. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present teacher. Fátima Alejandra Centeno Franco. Present teacher. Thank you. Gilmar Cruz Méndez Méndez. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jonathan Alexander Pineda Díaz. Jorge Elvir Miranda Ramos. José Francisco Hernández Ábalos. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara González. Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Thank you, Carla. Present. María Emelina Iraeta de Salinas. Present teacher. Maritza Alcira Castellón Celaya. 
Misael Rivera Aquino. Present teacher. Thank you. Nancy Lizette Rodriguez Escoto. Present teacher. Romeo teacher. Alexis. Yes, thank you. Rodriguez Joaquin. Jasmine Melanie Lemus Rodriguez. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, then we have Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Present teacher. Mariano Jose Paca Santa Maria. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutierrez de Durán. Present teacher. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Ana Milcar Cañengues Aceitún. Present. All right. Les doy un poquito más de tiempo. Are you guys finished? More time. More time. All right. More time. Okay. That's fine. Ay, sal saluda, pues, saluda a los todos, mira. Hola, Ay, hola. Hi. 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 What's your name? Um, Hello. Hello. Oh. Hi. 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 Hello, Hello. How are you? Hello. Hi. Ya va aprendiendo, ya va aprendiendo, ya. Hi. 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 Is Mateo Daniel. Ah, very nice. Hi, Mateo. Hello, Ricky. Hello. Hello. Mm I'm finished, teacher. I really took a look. All right, everyone else is finished or only Daniel is finished? I'm finished. Excellent, very nice. Okay, volunteers, tell me what kind of job do you do, guys? Um, me, teacher. Okay, Maria Melina, yes, mm. go ahead. Um, I'm in charge of one of two branch of the business. Um, I do all activity about the uh, business administration. Okay. Um, I have to open the business in the morning and I have to close. And um, I'm organized the personal schedules. I have to do the product orders. Okay. I have to do the suppliers payments. Okay, oh nice, okay. And I check the inventory and I have to do customer service activities also. Okay. 
All right. All right. So those those are some of your responsibilities, Maria Marina. Thank you. All right. Yes. Perfect. Let's see. Um, another volunteer. I want to hear volunteers. Hi, Jorge Elvir. Good evening. Good evening. So sorry for the delay. That's fine. Thank you for joining. All right. Someone else to share? Their... Yes, Johnny. Thank you. Uh, I'm not sure, but mm -hmm. I collaborate with the coordination in the school. Okay. Uh, and other responsibilities. Mm -hmm. I care to the students in the breaks. And I help with the biosecurity protocol. Oh, very good. Nice, Johnny. All right. Para decir cuidar, Johnny, is I take care. Oh. All right. Oh, yo, yo, yo pensaba que cuando decían take care es como ten cuidado. También. <laughs> Oh. All right, yes. Si usted solo dice yeah. I care, es como que me importan los estudiantes, lo cual también es cierto, pero, all right, that's not what you want to say. All right. Okay, very good. Thank you. All right, someone else. Me, teacher. Yes, okay, Daniel, thank you. Okay, in my work, in my work I, I have a job of Ram Hagen. Okay. And one of my responsibilities is uh, clean the ramp okay. and parking the airplanes, parking the helicopters, drive the forklift, and clean the fire extinguisher. Oh, okay, Daniel. Very good. All right, one more. Yes. Uh, my job, accounting administrative assistant. Okay, all right. Uh, and my responsibilities are complete with the tax and labor of the company. Okay. En resumen. <laughs> all right, very good. That's a short summary. Yes, very good. Thank you. Planillas, right. planillas, impuestos, y ahí va. Yeah, all right, the payroll and all those things. All right, interesting. Ya vamos a seguir usando lo que acaban de escribir en sus grupos, pero let's go right now to page 26. All right, it says everyday tasks. Do you understand what tasks are? Yes, no. What uh, are tasks? Tareas. No. Yes, like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Tareas diarias. Yeah, very good. Yes, they are. All right, like a, like short as, or small activities that you have to do. All right, so those are tasks. A ver, it says take a look at some common tasks of personnel at a restaurant. How different or similar are with yours? Okay, number one. A ver, Maritza, regáleme la lectura de... Maritza está por ahí. Sí. All right, number one, two, and three. Donde dice meet, meet, call, and order. Eso es tres. Okay. Meet the here chief to review the week, weekly menu. Okay. Call a marketing company about promotional souvenir. Order the inventory. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Let's see. What about... Um, Nancy, Lisette, can you read the other three? Where it says talk, interview, and check, please. Nancy, no? Okay. What about, let me see here. Marlon, can you read the other three? Talk, interview, and check, please. All right, guys. See, ya ven, when you turn off your camera, no sé si están por ahí. All right, Edwin Eliseo, tell me the three talk, interview, and check. Edwin? Mm -hmm. Three. Check the weekly schedule. Sí, las, las otras dos también. Eliseo, hagan el favor. Order the inventory. Las que están arriba de check the weekly schedule, de Eliseo, Edwin. Ah, interview potential employees. Mm -hmm. 
Y la que está arriba de... To... <risa> talk to the staff about change, change. ¿Cómo es, teacher? Changes. Change. 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 Exacto, change. muy bien, Elisa. Very good, Edwin. Yes. All right, very good. So here we have meet the head chef to review the weekly menu, call a marketing company about promotional souvenirs, order the inventory, talk to the staff about changes in the schedule, and interview potential employees. And the last one, check the weekly schedule all right now what are you going to do you're going to work on this right now where it says per work write the task you do in your workplace similar a lo que hicieron individual con las preguntas que teníamos aquí what are some of your responsibilities all right All right, entonces ustedes van a poner your tasks, pero les van a preguntar a sus compañeros, what about you? What are some of your responsibilities? Si usted está trabajando con Ever, le va a preguntar, Ever, what are some of your responsibilities? Ever le va a mencionar cuatro o cinco cuando las escriba, porque sí quiero que las escriban, van a escribir en tercera persona singular porque usted no es Ever. All right, entonces va a decir, Ever, uh, Purchases the material, all right, or ever does the inventory. No sé, lo que él le cuente que él hace, cuáles son las responsabilidades, usted lo escribe en tercera persona singular, ok. Esto donde dice your task es similar a las responsibilities que estábamos hablando hace un ratito, ok. Entonces, the idea es que por lo menos tengan unas tres, all right, cada quien. Cuando ya las tengan listas, que de hecho ya las tienen porque cada quien la escribió, or individualmente, so you are going to ask. Si está con Fátima, Fátima, what are some of your responsibilities? And Fátima is going to tell you, you have to pay attention and then you write. Fátima, blah, blah, blah. All right? Makes um, interviews, for example. All right? O lo que sea que ella haga o le mencione que son sus responsabilidades. Nos vamos a ir a los mismos grupos, solo voy a agregar a Jorge Elvir y los demás si sí, regresamos a los mismos. Let's go, guys. And a Trinidad también.
All right, everybody ready? Amilcar? Amilcar, cuando lo veo así, me da más frío, Amilcar. <laughs> es que ya es el lado, ¿verdad? Sí, y fíjese que yo tengo, yo padezco de sinusitis. Ajá. Y la mía es alérgica, entonces, cuando, fíjese que es contradictorio, porque yo vivo en una zona fría, con polvo, esporas, entonces todo esto a mí me afecta. Y ahorita que el clima está mero, mero templado, sí. se me, la mollera siento que se me quiebra el dos. Pero ya con el gorro me, me quedo más tranquilo. Ay, disculpe la apariencia. No, no. La cara aguanta. No, no se preocupe, it's ok. Así se ve bien cozy. All right, very good, guys. Ok, I'm not going to ask questions about what your classmates told you because that's the idea was that you shared with them. But now I have some questions for you, ok? Vamos a ver. I'm going to ask you some questions. No se las voy a poner, solo las voy a ver yo. And I want you to tell me your answers, all right? I want you to practice your speaking. So question number one is for Amilcar. Ya que estamos hablando, Amilcar. A ver. Okay. Amilcar, do you like your job? If your answer is yes, why do you like your job? And if your answer is no, why don't you like your job? Okay. Okay, uh, some time, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why, Amilcar? For example, when, when pay me. <laughs> ah, okay, when you get paid. You like your no. job when you get paid, yes. Yeah, in serio, yes, I like it. Okay. Yes, I like it because uh, I studied uh -huh. for this job. Okay. Or for, for, for I have this job. Okay, for you to have this job. Very good. Okay. Yes. All right. So in general, you like it. Uh, in general. Okay. I like it. All right. Very good. Thank you. A ver, Amilcar, choose someone else. A quien le vamos a preguntar ahora? A mi amigo Carlos. Carlos. Mi compañero de grupo. Alberto. Yeah. Okay, Carlos yeah. Alberto, ready, Carlos? Yes. All right. What job would you like to have and why? Uh, simple. I like my job. Okay. I would... don't. <laughs> I, I don't. Uh, I don't drink with uh, other oh. other job. <laughs> oh, okay, Carlos, perfect, very good. Okay, excellent. All right, so no, you wouldn't have like to have another job. Okay, very good. You don't dream with another one. Very good, Carlos. Choose another one of your classmates, please. Tenemos aquí suficientes para todos. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, Marco David Velasquez. Okay. <laughs> Yes. yes. All right, ready. Yes, my, my job, I love my job because I like the the all complicated. <laughs> all right, very good. Yes. Now I like to resolve the, the problem of okay. analysis or logic. Ah. Um, I like uh have my my mind occupied. occupied or busy. Occupied. Yeah. All right, Marcos, but I have another question for you, okay? Yeah, so. What job would you hate to have? Así como que se dice, no, pero ni modo, all right? What job would you hate yeah, to uh, have? Um, it's difficult to say some about that because okay. I, I work in other areas uh -huh. and mechanic and mechanic uh-huh pharma uh okay. um, building okay um carpenter and structured metallic and okay. uh, 
I am technical farmer mm -hmm. and apiculture. Okay. You're uh, everything, I have, Marco. <laughs> I have, I have oh, uh, other things, oh, but I, I love all, all, all uh, I do it. I love it because but it's, uh, it, it's but work. Ma and... Yeah, yeah, it is. But Marco, think about some, any job that you say, no, that's not for me, that I wouldn't mm -hmm. like to do. But I don't do it. Some something I I don't love it. Love that. All right. Uh, but okay. it's it's difficult to say that. Okay. That. All right. That's fine. That's okay. That, but your answer was very nice. Let's see, Marco. Tell me someone else. Choose someone else from your classmates. All right. With Maritza Alcira. Maritza. Think about El Salvador, Maritza, ¿ok? ¿Dónde está Maritza? Ahí está. A la par mí no la veía. A ver, Maritza, do you think it's easy or difficult to find a job in El Salvador? It's very difficult. Why, Maritza? Why? Because um, and the person near to to the experience to have experience uh -huh. to have experience and the titulo universitario the university degree uh -huh, or diploma uh -huh. um, um the more important is the experience okay all right so in your opinion maritza it is difficult to find a job in el salvador yes yes all right it's okay difficult. okay very good maritza choose someone else please um francisco francisco ah huh, ready francisco ready sorry Yes. All right, yes. Francisco. In your opinion, what are the three jobs with high salaries in El Salvador? With high salaries. High salaries, yes, a lot of money <laughs> in uh, El Salvador. Los diputados. <laughs> <laughs> yes. El presidente. The most common. Ese no cobra. All right, I uh, have uh, 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 I believe that the job that I have a uh, high salary uh -huh. uh, is a call center and oh. in, in bilingual. Bilingual call centers, okay. Bilingual call center. Okay. Um, and also uh, maybe, for example, an engineer system because okay. the technologies uh, are improving uh, every day. For okay. Example. And the last one, for example, the, what do you say? The pilot, pilot. Pilots, yes. Uh huh. Uh, I think that the pilot maybe is a is a job that has a high high salary. All right, perfect, very good, Francisco. Thank you. Very nice, Francisco. Okay. It's, it's fancy. Okay. Yes, it is. All right, very good, Francisco. Choose someone else, please. So we have another question for them. Um, Johnny. Johnny, what are, are you ready, Johnny? Yes. What are the three jobs with low salary? Three jobs with the lowest salary in El Salvador. <laughs> low salary. <laughs> uh depends on the 
company. Uh-huh. Uh, but, um, I don't know. Oh, uh, the limpieza janitor. Uh, uh, janitors, janitors. The janitors. Uh-huh. Um, in, in other schools, Mm -hmm. uh, teachers. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, and. Uh, iba a decir, uh, Amilcar. <laughs> I love it. I know. Uh -huh. He said, in other schools, not in his school. <laughs> yes, in other Very school. <laughs> Very good, Johnny. Very good observation, Amilcar. Uh -huh. Another one, Johnny. Uh, journalist? No, no. Jornaleros. Yes. That's... All right. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. Interesting. Very good. I have a question. Yes. How do you say se sector agricola? Farmers. Farmers. Agriculture. Farmers. The agriculture okay. sector. Yeah. Farmers. Yeah. Of course. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. They, okay. they win seventy dollars. Uh, to the, me acuerdo cómo se llama. Of the day. Son los que oh, ganan el pago en el país. Ahí, eh, we need to refuse the, the minimal salary. Los cañeros. Los cañeros, dice el video. Sí. All right. Ellos ganan bien bajo. Traen mucho, mucho, mucha persona inmigrante de Nicaragua y de otros lados. Yes, yes. It's yeah. true. All right. Y, Yeah. Con, very, con, very, con very, lo que ganan, con lo que ganan así don't allá. like the, the works or jobs. Yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. All right. Yeah, Muy right. bien. Acuérdense que cuando decimos ganar, no de gané una rifa, sino Muy ganar bien. de salario, decimos earn. ¿Verdad? They earn like, like the lowest salary. E -A -R -N, E-A-R-N, earn. E A R N, earn. Er. Mm -hmm. Earn. Entonces er. se dice: Yo gano, por decir algo, 400 dólares. I earn 400 dólares. Mm -hmm. I earn. A month. And I can use in get. Oh, yes, get. E A R N. Ahorita se los escribo en el chat. A ver, earn. E R M. Ajá, E R M. A R N. Earn. Usted le pregunta, si usted le pregunta a alguien, usted le pregunta how much, no dice how much do you win, le dice how much do you earn. Do you earn? Sí, Francisco yeah. decía get tal bien, pero es más informal, Francisco. Ah, ok. How much do you earn? Es All como right. cuando le dice cuánto tienes en el, en el trabajo. <ríe> Ajá, ya. Yeah. Entonces cuando usted dice how much do you earn, la persona a la cual usted le está preguntando le va a decir I earn. Uh, $400 minimum wage, $500, lo que gane. All right, yes. Per hour. No se pregunta, ¿no? <laughs> claro. <laughs> All right, per hour, <laughs> monthly, or, yeah, okay. Very good. Esa pregunta es como difícil, ¿verdad? That one, the, the lowest one, is like a lot of jobs in this country. All right, next one. A ver, eh, Johnny, regáleme otro compañero, please. Bueno, no me lo regale el nombre, regáleme. <laughs> Okay. Um, question. Yes, Amilcar. Pero está fuera de contexto, no importa. Eh, ¿Qué tan afuera? No, dele, dele. No. <laughs> academia is equal a university. Academia. Yes. Okay. No. Maybe no. No, is college equal. puede ser similar, es educación superior, college. Oops, college college and university. Academia. Y academia sería como algo independiente. Sí. Como algo ajá. extra. Sí, claro. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. very good. Oh, That's okay. A ver, Johnny, someone else, please. Tenemos todavía para okay. cinco más. Ajá. Carla. Carlita. Carlita, ready? Um, Carla, ¿me escucha, Carla? Yes, sir. Okay. What are three dangerous jobs in El Salvador? Three dangerous. Three wow. dangerous jobs. Uh huh. Mm. In 
your opinion, Carlita, obviamente, all right? Okay. Uh, the electric car tank. Oh, all right. Ahí le vamos a preguntar a los compañeros, all right? The electricians, okay. Another one? Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know. Police? Diputado. Excuse me, Carla. Life jacket. No sé si se pronuncia. Guardaespaldas. Sí, no sé. um, uh -huh. O salvavidas. Ah, lifeguards. Mm. Lifeguards. Uh -huh. Lifeguards. Yes. Okay. All right. The police. Police. Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay. Interesting. Carlita, choose another classmate, please. Fireman. Yeah. Okay. Fatima. Fatima. Mm, a ver, Fatima. Fátima, do you Fátima me escucha? Yes. Oh, yeah, Fátima. <laughs> Fátima, in your opinion, do you think it's better to have a job outdoors or indoors? It's outdoor, outdoors. Outdoors is outside. And indoors is inside. In an office is inside. Outside is like, I don't know, like um on the, on the field, all right? Que no pasa ni en oficina, my sino que es más afuera. My, uh -huh. my job. Uh -huh. my in, job. To be sitting the in, Inside. Excuse okay. me, Fatima? Inside, o sea, de Ah, because, indoors. Uh -huh. Uh -huh, indoors, because the activity is mm, más fácil. Actividad Easier? Más fácil. Easier? Uh -huh. Easier? Sí. Okay. Um, okay. The situation in, in El Salvador is very difficult. Okay. Afuera. All right. Yes, to be outside. Okay. Yes, I hear you. Very nice. Good. Okay, Fatima, the last one. Choose one more student or classmate from here. Maria Melina. Maria Melina. A ver, Maria Melina. <laughs> Maria Melina, this is a funny question. Which one do you think is better? Working or doing nothing? <laughs> Check on, option. <laughs> Working, teacher. Working. Why, Maria because, Melina? <laughs> because... Um, Work is depending nothing of nothing, teacher. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes you say um, you don't do nothing, but you have to work in the house. Right. right? Okay. But if you ask me working in outside uh -huh. or inside of the house, mm -hmm. um, I like to to stay working. Okay. All right. Um, okay. Because um, I had like a, a years ago in my house for mm -hmm. two years. Okay. And it was not working. It, it is uh, boring. It is um, um, Oh, no, for you say, um, it's stressante estar yeah. haciendo lo mismo. <laughs> All right, it becomes a stressing, yes, to be doing yeah. the same thing. All right, yes. very good, Maria Melina. Thank I like you. To work. Yes, I okay, very good. I think we all do in a way. <laughs> all right, guys, very good. I'm gonna take the last attendance of the night. Igual mañana vamos a continuar un poquito con esas preguntas because the idea is for you to practice your speaking, all right? So that's the whole point of this. Very good, guys. A los que no preguntamos ahora, mañana no se preocupe que mañana es su turno. Let's see, Carlos Roberto Garcia Ramirez. 
Carlos Humalberto Rodríguez. Present. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present. Domingo Alexander González. Present. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Present. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Fátima Alejandra Centeno Franco. Present. Fátima, hoy se queda conmigo un ratito. Gilmar Cruz Méndez Méndez. A Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jonathan Alexander Pineda Díaz. Jorge Elvir Miranda Ramos. Present. José Francisco Hernández Ábalos. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara González. Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Present. María Emelina Iraeta de Salinas. Present teacher. Maritza Alcira Castellón Celaya. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Misael Rivera Aquino. Present teacher. Nancy Lizet Rodriguez Escoto. Thank you. A Romeo Alexis Rodriguez Joaquín. Yasmin Melanie Lemus Rodriguez. Present teacher. Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Present teacher. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Thank you. Present uh, teacher. Yes, thank you. Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Thank you. Amilcar Cañengues Aceituno. Present. Excellent, guys. Very good. Thank you so much for joining class. And I will see you all tomorrow. And tomorrow's already Friday. Bye, guys. Have a good night. Rest. Bye. No se olvide trabajar en la plataforma. Good night. Sigan avanzando. Bye. Good night. Good night. See you. So sorry, oh. teacher, for me. Friday. Today. That's okay, Elvir, but you were here at the end, all right? So that's good. Yes. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you. you guys. Bye. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Bye, Miss Maritza. <laughs> Bye. Good night. Have a good night. Bye. All right, Fatima, how are you? You're fine? Un poco cansada. Sí, Bye. I a lot of tired. Yes, I'm very <laughs> tired. Do you work every day, Fatima? Yes, every day. Every day, okay. And where do you work, Fatima? Remind me. Where do you work? I work in a company distributor in Santa Tecla. Mm -hmm. All right. It's called JFM teacher. All right. So what do you do, Fatima, at your job? What is, like, what do you do? I am a an accountant. An accountant. Oh, all right. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Fatima, do you have any questions about the classes, about anything that you don't understand? Do you need help with anything? Eh, con el uso del science y el from teacher. El from Creo el que tiendo con... Uh, El form, ajá, quiero confundirme <risa> cuando, cuando usar, porque creo okay, que esa clase, no sé si me la perdí, sí creo que fue la que me perdí. Uh -huh. sí, y que... sí escuché, pero no, no okay. sé, alguna, porque sí. anoté que cuando se tiene como fecha específica, uso uh -huh. el signs. Signs. Since. Ajá, since. Y cuando tengo un el inicio y un, eh, hay una cantidad, es uh -huh. el for. Sí. No. Lo que pasa es que el for, eh, usted dice, por decirle algo, yo um, he trabajado por 11 años, for 11 years, pero no me dice desde cuándo. All right. Mientras que usted me dice, ah, uh -huh. teacher, I have worked at this company since 2015, me da un inicio. All right, y me, se vuelve específico donde inició, ¿verdad? Y, uh -huh. en, y también sigue trabajando en ese mismo lugar, ¿ya? Entonces usted dice, I have worked okay. since nine, uh, 2015. 
Alright. Entonces, es como, bueno, en español, ¿verdad? Porque igual decimos, since es desde. Y usted dice, yo he trabajado ahí desde el 2015, por cuatro años. Es diferente, ¿verdad? Entonces, igual es el since y el for. Ok. O sea, el, el for me da un periodo de tiempo, pero no me especifica cuándo empezó. ¿Verdad? Usted me dice, yo he estudiado inglés por un año. O sea, sí puede haber... Uh -huh. ah, no, hay, no hay una fecha, no hay una fecha específica, entonces no hay un, un año específico, solo un tiempo. Es como que no hubiera inicio, ajá, no me dice el inicio de cuándo empezó o desde cuándo empezó esa actividad. Uh -huh. Usted me dice, yo empecé a estudiar inglés desde el 2020, All right. ya lleva dos años, ¿verdad? Entonces dice, ah, yo he estudiado uh -huh. inglés por dos años, pero no sé cuándo empezó. Ok, ese es el for. I have studied English for two years. Pero me dice, I have studied English since 2020. Quiere decir que empezó y continúa estudiando, no ha terminado. Ok. Ok, teacher. Entonces, más o menos por ahí vamos. Es como seguir eh, esa línea, más o menos. ¿Verdad? A veces nos da, nos, es como tener que leer la, la oración completa. Por lo general, estas dos preposiciones se ocupan para el presente perfecto. Cuando usted dice, yo he trabajado en esta empresa por 20 años. He trabajado. No dice trabajé, ¿verdad? Yo he trabajado, quiere decir que sigue trabajando en esa empresa. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok, Very good. All right. No sé si tiene alguna otra pregunta, Fátima. No, no, creo que ahí era esa parte yeah. de la clase. Ok. Uh -huh. Y acuérdese que el from y el to es cuando hay, hay dos tiempos, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, nosotros tenemos clase eh, from 8 to 10, ¿verdad? O usted si trabajara de lunes a jueves, por decir algo. I work from Monday to Thursday. To Thursday. From y el to. Mm, uh -huh. Ok. Pronto, ajá, ahí había también esa parte. Ajá, exacto. All right. Muy bien, Fátima. Pero es, sí, ajá, es diciendo adverbio de tiempo. Son adverbios de tiempo, ¿verdad? Son Pero, preposiciones de time tiempo. Expression. Sí. Uh -huh. Prepositions of time or time expression, sí. Ok. Uh -huh. Thank you, teacher. Uh -huh. Bueno, ok, Fátima, vaya a descansar. Gracias por quedarse un ratito más conmigo y la veo mañana. Primero Dios, siga adelantando en la plataforma. Oye. Gracias, bye. teacher. Bueno, cuídense. Have a good night. Bye, good night. Adiós. Descanse, bye. bye. bye.